Hi everyone, it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Hey, what did I tell you? No copyrighted stuff. Right, uh, we're here at the Faith Comes By Hearing headquarters once again, just to give a recap of the last few weeks, as well as to share some of the incredible stuff that God is doing here in 2020. So let's go. Faith Comes By Hearing is about one thing, getting God's word to every person. Our vision is to partner with like-minded ministries to record scripture in every language of the world that needs it by the year 2033, and then to make these recordings freely available by every means possible. In the first episode, we talked about how the language recording department coordinates all the audio Bible recordings happening around the world each day. As you can see, there are a ton of people across the world that need scripture in audio. At least 70% of the world's population, in fact. Yep. Once we get a partnership with a translation ministry, we have to get it recorded. An expert recording team goes to the field and records native speakers reading the Bible in their heart language. They send it back here, and our team of audio processors edits and masters the recording. Oh, hey. Not you again. Okay, I won't do another take of John 1. I won't do it. No, no nope. more, I, I promise. No more. Not one more. Not one more. Yes, well, moving on. <laughs> Once the recordings are mastered, the production department loads them onto audio playback devices such as Bible sticks or proclaimers and then ships them across the world. People can then hear God speak their language, often for the very first time. But we don't just put the Bible on proclaimers. Anyone with a smartphone can listen to the Bible too through the free Bible Is app. Oh, is that the new Bible is? It is. Uh, is, it, is it ready yet? It is ready. Can I take a look? You can. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Check it out. In the wow. beginning was the Word. This is amazing. And the word so cool. Was with God, wait. And the word oh, wait, was sir. God. Hello. Hold on. That's my personal phone. Now then, in episode four, we talked about oral Bible translation. This is for when a language may not have a written form. It's an audio to audio translation process. And it's a great tool for oral communities to get the Bible in audio as soon as it's recorded and consultant approved. Native speakers use objects and storyboards to internalize a Bible story. Then they listen to the scripture in one language they know, then translate it into their mother tongue. This way, oral communities around the world can finally hear God's word. Matthew, uh, England there are everybody. England there are everybody. I'm sorry, I, I, I still... England there are everybody. I'm sorry, I, I, I still, I still, I can't understand what, what, what you're saying. I'm, I'm sorry. Next, we got to talk about gospel films. Through our partnership with the Lumo Project, people can hear and see the word-for-word -word gospels in their heart language for the very first time. Let's see, I, I, I think I might have time to show you one little clip. Let's see. Let's see. Matthew. Victor, uh, do, do, we have a, do we have a situation? No, man, I just wanted to tell you what a great job you've been doing. Oh, thanks, Victor. I, I appreciate that. 2020 is projected to be a great year here at Faith Comes By Hearing. We're planning to record 150 more languages, start 100,000 more listening programs all around the world that together will disciple an average of 9 million people and adapt at least 250 more gospel films. Our mission, as always, is to get God's word to every person and to see lives, families, and whole communities eternally transformed by the gospel. But this great task of covering the world with the word can't be done without your faithful support. Over the past four decades, people like you have come alongside us to send the Bible in audio to the ends of the earth. And for that, we all want to thank you. Thank you! See you guys next time.